So Anil, you spoke today about AI for everyone. Can you tell me a little bit about what is AI? It is the idea of how we as humans can train computers to learn and adapt and be able to solve really important problems for humanity at scale. Whereas machine learning is actually how we train the computers. Why is this such an interesting time for AI and ML? We're seeing incredible advancements in technology and computational power. So not only are algorithms getting better and are we have access to larger data sets to help train our systems, but if you think of the computational power from 40 years ago to where it is today, computers are thousands times more uh, powerful and capable than they were back then. And so we're now able to build these systems to be able to achieve these incredible um, applications to solve these problems in ways that we really never could before. How does Google think about applying AI to its various efforts? So the first is we think about how we bring AI into our own products. The second is how we provide a set of tools and capabilities to our partners and developers to build AI applications. And then the third is our involvement in applications that are helping society and, and really about humanity. In the case of the first, there's a number of great applications to mention. Google Photos uh, uses AI. Pixel 2 has a great camera in portrait mode that's able to do this with just one camera and able to use neural networks to actually be able to blur the backgrounds. In terms of tools that we have, there's TensorFlow, which is our open source platform for machine learning that anyone can get access to for free. We have Google Cloud AI, which is a set of APIs, including things like uh, speech to text or computer vision. And then we We've built hardware with our tensor processing units. And then finally, we're focused on being able to bring AI into society in a way that is making some really uh, important changes to humanity and for, for positive good. And so these are applications like healthcare, or uh, we're seeing in environmental conservation, or even things like gender bias. We're able to use AI to be able to solve some really important problems. Is AI mainly for engineers and people who are really technical? Uh, no, in fact, it's, uh, it's very much something that I think is going to be intrinsic in everything we do and in our, in our life. And for us to get AI right, for us to make the, the right applications for society, for us to really uh, have the impact that we know it needs to, to have, this is something that everyone needs to be part of, whether you are a creative, whether you are a philosopher, or whether you uh, study ethics. Um, everyone really needs to participate in this conversation. The future of AI is incredibly bright but also that there's a deep responsibility that we as Google feel and we're working collectively with everyone to make sure that we're building the right applications in the right way. But when we do so, I think that we're going to see that AI truly is the multiplier of human ingenuity.